wonderful people how are you doing welcome to my channel and um, today we're talking face we're talking what am i doing for my face we are talking what am i doing for this acne it's a struggle it's a struggle and um i'm learning things here and there the things that are working for me there are things that are not working for me if you have um a routine that is working for for you please be kind enough to put it down in the uh, comments so I can try it out because this is a struggle I have two clays that I love to use one of them is the most common everybody has it probably the Aztec secret Indian healing clay I use this a lot and sometimes I interchange it with Russell Clay, the coarse grade Russell Clay from Morocco. So first things first, let's see what the Russell Clay does to your skin. Exceptional Russell Clay is rich in silica, potassium, magnesium, and calcium. Russell Clay's most impressive properties that benefit the skin is its capacity to absorb. Studies have shown that it is reputed to reduce the dryness and flakiness of the skin while improving the texture of the skin. Isn't that what we all want? Russell Clay soaks up excess sebum in skin that overproduces oil, helping to rebalance sebum production and help return equilibrium, which will prevent future breakouts. Russell's unique absorbing properties draw excess oil and impurities from the skin like a magnet i've actually seen this happen to me this clay pulls out the whiteheads for me and my skin becomes clear thank you morocco a little bit of this apple cider vinegar this is the one with the mother you want a consistency close to toothpaste, I think. So, I also like to put in tea tree oil. Tea tree oil is a natural antibacterial agent that actually cleanses up the skin. Tea tree oil is popular is a popular choice for treating acne because of its anti-inflammatory and anti-microbial properties. It's thought to calm redness, swelling, and inflammation. It may even help to prevent and reduce acne scars, leaving you with smooth, clear skin. For drops, like to dump in there some peppermint and rosemary. I don't know the benefits, I just know that every oil is beneficial, so. Before I apply, I'm gonna go wet my face with hot water. Like, just splash my face a lot with uh, hot water to open up the pores. I'm gonna not wipe it off, but pat dry with my face cloth. And then just apply, lightly just patting off the water not taking out all of it leaving the face moist I apply that I look so pretty I love this face <laughs> in a minute I know I'm not gonna be able to even laugh or, or even talk So we're gonna wait for this to dry up and then wash it off and moisturize now it's completely dry I can't even talk that much because my face is tight it's pulling together so I'm gonna go wash it off I wonder if I stretch my mouth up and what will happen let me see Mm. oh wow i actually see 
little tiny hairs stuck on it and like things that look like white heads as well but it's so satisfying to just pull them off <laughs> So I'm back with my face washed so I'm just gonna pat dry my next step would be toning so I use um, Mario Bades Badesu or Bades Badesu I think I use Mario Badesu glycolic acid toner for my face glycolic acid is an exfoliator when that is done i go in with my vitamin c serum it's 20 percent vitamin c and hyaluronic acid and also has vitamin e so and they say it's um advanced anti-aging serum once that is done i go in with my Neutrogena Hydro Boost Multivitamin Booster. This is the one that has little uh, ball things inside. It's not oily and um, it keeps my face really moisturized for a long time. So I go in with that. I'm so upset with my face right now. No, with myself actually. The past maybe month or so I've neglected my face and I'm starting to get like big acne and you know I'm like upset but I, my game was on point and then uh, I snoozed I lost so don't snooze guys after that I go in with all free also acne moisturizer with a pink grapefruit this one has Salic salicylic acid for acne treatment my face wash and my acne oil moisture oil free moisturizer are the same uh, thing just the one is a face wash and one is a moisturizer <sighs> that is it actually that was it <laughs> but the last Thing is for my lips my lips were getting raggedy you know with the cold weather outside they were getting raggedy and the only thing that has worked for me is this Eucerin uh, Eucerin Aquafa healing ointment so I use this all the time all the time and my lips are way better than they were so if you're struggling with your lips, this is something you can, you know, use. So no makeup today. It's just a normal, like, you know, home face, face, whatever for acne treatments, uh, things that can help with your acne. So thank you for watching. Subscribe if you haven't already. And let's share with each other. You learn from me, I learn from you, and we spread the gospel of no acne. Acne must leave the chat. Anyway, bye. Peace and out. No, I just came to switch up the camera and then I realized, oh wow, my face. See that? See how it, it feels like... Uh, it's just perfect. Okay, bye for real. Bye.